All right, guys. So let's yeah. see today when we're gonna read Money Ninja. So we read about Angry Ninja, Lying Ninja, uh, Honest Ninja. We read about Positive Ninja. We read about all these great ninjas. I wonder what this one's gonna be about. This is very interesting when I saw it. I said, what could we be learning about ninjas? And again, just for our Facebook friends, we got a lot of new books that we're gonna be reading soon. I'm really excited. A little spot box set. We have eight awesome books here that we're gonna start reading. I'm really excited about that. We just got that today. So here is Money Ninja, and the book is green. Why do you think the book is green, guys? Because that's the color of money. Well, who said that? Me. Oh my God, Luke, you're so smart. Nice. We had also read, there's other ninjas too, like Shy Ninja, Helpful Ninja, Kind Ninja. Look at this, it has all the ninjas in the back. I gotta see which ones we have, which ones we don't have, so we can order all the ones that we don't have. It's like mom. Look at this. Mm, thinking about money. That's interesting. Whoa! Oh my goodness, this is Caleb's favorite car. Anybody knows what kind of car that is? Are you gonna see it? No, wait. Is that a Honda? It's not a Honda. I'll give you guys a clue. It runs on electricity. It just uses electricity, no gas. Tesla. Tesla? Tesla, that's right. Oh my Elon goodness. Okay, that's a commer that's a commercial for Tesla. So if Elon Musk is listening, please yeah. make a donation. I want to Google a <laughs> uh, car that's auto no driver. Yeah. Future. So all right, we're gonna go on mute now so we can listen to the book and then we'll unmute to listen to everybody's questions at the end, okay? Deal? Deal. Deal. Good. All right. Money Ninja was filling his can filling his candy machine and collecting the money he made. Meanwhile, Unplugged Ninja was explaining what he was going to do with his birthday money. After I buy five packs of Pokemon cards, I'm going to buy a new remote control for my PC. That's awesome! Look at this. Money Ninja is filling up his candy machine and then people are buying the candy and he's getting more money. Over here, and then it's just saying all the cool things that he's doing with his birthday money. Anybody ever got money for their birthday? Raise your hand, let me see. Ooh, oh, a lot of people got money for their birthday. After they got home, Money Ninja sold lemonade while Unplugged Ninja continued to talk about spending all his money. So look at this, Money Ninja goes ahead and starts a lemonade stand. While Unplugged Ninja is just buying everybody lemonade. He's spending all his birthday money fast. Oh my goodness. Wow, he must have got a lot of birthday money. After an afternoon of selling lemonade, Money Ninja decided to make a video for his YouTube channel. Who knows YouTube? He had been documenting the entire day. Everything he did. He was making money from his YouTube channel, just sharing his daily happenings. Hey, what are you going to do with that money? You'll see. Wow, look at that. Money Ninja sounds pretty interesting. He's doing something very, very different with his money. He's just not spending it and he keeps on doing cool ideas to make more money. He had the candy selling, he already had the YouTube channel, he had the lemonade stand. Whoa, what do you think, lad? It's pretty cool. When they arrived at the room, 4322, Money Ninja handed his hard-earned money 
to Brave Ninja's mother. Wow, he gave it to Brave Ninja's mother. Brave Ninja had recently been diagnosed with leukemia. The money was going to help pay for his doctor bills. Oh no, look at this, Brave Ninja got diagnosed with leukemia. Oh my goodness, and look, he gave it to his mom. So he had been working all that so hard, saving money, doing the lemonade stand, selling candy, YouTube channel, and he gave it all away to his mom right here. His mom's name is Faith. And here it is, very here he is, uh, Brave Ninja. He's very brave. He's fighting leukemia right here in the hospital bill. So I bet he has a lot of hospital bills. It's probably really expensive. That's so nice of him. On the way home, Money Ninja explained, you can do other things with your money besides spend it, you know. You can invest it, save it, or donate it. I've never thought about that, said Unplug Ninja. Can you tell me more? Sure, I'll show you, said Money Ninja. Wow. He is a Money Ninja. When I got money for my birthday, one of the first things I did was to save some for my car. By the time I turn 16, I'll have 10,000 saved up from in my bank account, explained Money Ninja. Saving helps us develop delayed gratification. Oh my goodness, that's a big word. Can you guys say delayed gratification? Delayed gratification. That's a good quality to have. It means we're patient. Well, that's definitely one of the things we learn when we're learning to be black belts. Money Ninja tip. If you deposit $100 into a checking account, your money will collect interest. The bank may pay you up to $3 so that you can have, in turn, instead of $100, turn it into $103. Well, that's pretty cool. So look at that. If you just don't spend it, the money, they give you more. That's kind of cool. And he even had to wait for another birthday. Another thing I did with my birthday money was invested. I invested in a lemonade stand, candy machines, and equipment for our YouTube channel, continued Money Ninja. Investing helps us become money savvy, which means smart with money. Everybody say money savvy. Money Here's another Money Ninja tip. If you invest, invest $10 into your business, like a lemonade stand, and you make $20 back, you just doubled your money. Who would like to get their birthday money doubled? Me. Whoa, I wanna get my birthday money doubled. Finally, the last thing I did with my birthday money was donate it. Donating to my church and to those that need makes me feel happy. Here's another Money Ninja tip. Sometimes what you do with your money gives you things you can't see, but you can feel. Wow. So sometimes what you do with your money gives you things that you can't see, but that you can feel. Look, he's helping this person out, giving them some money. And look, he has a lot of hearts around him. He must feel really, really nice about helping that person out that needs it. That was cool. You see, there are many things we can do with money besides spend it. Wow, I had no idea. I'm going to try it, said Unplugged Ninja. Developing delayed gratification 
there's that big word again. Can anybody say delayed gratification? Delayed gratification. Money savvy skills and donating to those in need are a, are a ninja's best weapons against instant gratification and greed. Wow, look at that. Now he's relaxing, drinking his lemonade. That is so cool. Wow, we learned so much in that book about money and delayed gratification, being smart with our money, right? When we talk about money savvy skills and how good it feels to donate. That's Money Ninja. Awesome. All right, I'm gonna go ahead. All right, let's unmute you guys. Let's keep, we'll keep our Facebook friends on for a little while. Let's listen to some of the things that you guys have to say. Let's, we're gonna unmute one at a time. Let's hear Maddie. Maddie, what do you think about Money Ninja? Did you have any ideas of maybe what you can do if you ever get birthday money again? You can save it in your piggy bank. You can save it in your big, you hear that lad? That's a good idea, lad. That's a good idea. Look, let's give lad a treat. Lad, you want a treat? Here, That was very good listening, lad. You got a treat for listening. That was good. Lad, do you ever save your kibbles? Lad doesn't save his kibbles. He eats all his kibbles. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Maybe he should try saving his kibbles. I think you should save some of your kibbles, Lad, so you can have some for tomorrow, okay? I guess we're gonna have to help him with that. Well, who else can tell me a, a good idea that they have that they can do with their birthday money instead of spending? Yes, Luke? Um, it's better to donate for people who are sick and don't have enough money for medicine. Yeah, donating to people who are sick and maybe don't have enough money for medicine. That's a great idea, Luke. That is so awesome. And I bet you, you would feel very good and the person who's sick would feel very good too. That is awesome. That's some black belt attitude right there. Who else can tell me one more thing of what it is, of what they can do with their birthday money besides spending? Who could tell me one more? Um, I can. Y you can? Yeah. What can you do? I can do. I can decorations. You can what? Get decorations? Yeah, so I can decorate the car. So you, you can decorate your what? Talk to the camera because I can hear you talk, looking away. You're going to be five? Oh my goodness. And what about when you get money if when you're, when you're five years old, what do you want to do with that money? I'm going to save it. You're going to save it. Nice. That's a good idea. I like it. That's great. Ninja money skills. Awesome. All right, guys. Well, I will see you guys all next time. You guys are awesome. I'm so happy. Thank you guys for being part of our story time. Yes, Maddie? Um, before we go, I'm just going to say that um, I like Lad because he's so cute. You like Lad? Let me show you Laddie. Laddie, he's over here sleeping on my lap. Here, let me show for Facebook friends. Here's Lad. Lad, is he so cute? Is it? Yeah. All right, bye, Facebook.